We are very excited about the 60th anniversary of the New Jersey State Bar Foundation. When you think back of the changes in society and in the law over those 60 years, it's extraordinary that the foundation has been at the forefront of incorporating those changes in society in a way that is understandable to the citizens of New Jersey. If you look at the people who have served as the presidents of the Bar Foundation, the officers and the volunteers, we have the titans of the New Jersey legal industry. The initial goals of the foundation were charitable and educational. Eventually, the mission of the foundation was crystallized to foster awareness of the law, the justice system, and violence prevention among New Jersey residents, to be a statewide resource for law-related education, to provide opportunities for lawyers to serve the public, and to foster professionalism and pride in the profession of law through public service. Initially, the Bar Foundation was housed in Trenton with the Bar Association. In 1988, a group of lawyers got together and raised the funding to establish our New Jersey Law Center here in New Brunswick. It's aptly named Law Center because it really is the epicenter of the legal community in the state of New Jersey. On any day, you'll see senior citizens here, you'll see school-age children here. It's amazing what goes on in this building. Objection speculation. The mock trial program is a perfect example of how attorneys, teachers, and judges work together for an excellent program for our youth. The students are provided an opportunity to present a mock trial. This helps the students in public speaking and in their civic education generally. As a result of being involved in the mock trial competition, I was able to see how important that program was to both the students and the teachers, and how the foundation did a wonderful job of educating the public in the justice system. One of our most successful programs, one of the programs that we are most proud of, address conflict resolution and anti-bullying initiatives. Almost 50% of the school districts in the state of New Jersey have had educators who have participated in our programs. We receive very positive feedback and we know that they are able to take what they learn through these programs, bring it back to their school districts and implement it in their classrooms and we know that this is making a difference in the lives of our New Jersey school children, in the lives of their families and in the lives of the teachers. The foundation plays an important role in ensuring that many people understand the law and how it impacts society. It's more than just dealing with the lawyers, it's dealing with the public. And it's important that the public understand what lawyers do. The way people get their information is changing. We've moved into social media through different platforms, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and we try to keep the public informed through regular postings and updates on civics programs, updates on the law, things that people should be aware of. I can tell you that you will learn a lot and you will be able to, on a daily basis, see the good work that the foundation does. We send out the Legal Eagle and Respect, which are newsletters that are talking about different issues in the law, with diversity, with inclusion, and it helps start the conversation and helps children deal with issues that they may not otherwise be taught in school. The work that the foundation does, both on the volunteer level and on the staff level, creates such a sense of pride for us, and given the fact that there's so many attorneys involved in this, and volunteer their time, but they do it tirelessly and honorably. We are acquitting our social responsibility as lawyers to our community, and I'm really, really proud of that. I just think of the impact we've had, and hopefully will continue to have in the future in everybody's lives, in small ways, in big ways. A law degree is a gift, and with that gift comes responsibility to give back. The foundation enables every lawyer in this state to give of themselves to promote education and charitable endeavors.